Right, we'll do a Belfruit tribute video because uh, we heard the sad news of the uh, demise of Belfruit Gaming in Nottingham this week. And they've been going around for donkey's years, haven't they? Like, um, way back to the Electros, like we have here, Nudge Gambler. And then they went on to the classic black box games that we see here. Golden shots, and then the system eighty three machines. We had the cops and robbers, didn't we? All those type of games, and then Scorpion one and Scorpion two and Scorpion four, Scorpion five, etc. And the dreaded deal or no deals, which have been around for quite a few years, around about 14 years with all the different versions and clones they did of that machine but we love retro we love the retro side of it so I'm going to do a video of these two Nudge Gambler and Golden Shot as a tribute and for any of you uh, who work at Bell Fruits or have worked at Bell Fruits I hope uh, Everything goes well for you in the future. Such a sad loss. I've had quite a few bell fruits in my time. Bell fruit machines, I should say. <laughs> we'll load these two up with a few guys, you know, just a tribute. Just so sad the way the industry's gone over the years. And when today's machine's been so greedy and costing a fortune to play. That's where why they've lost a lot of customer base. Machines offering two bigger jackpots. People chasing the money, it's just not fair. Can I hold them on and hope the ghost of nudges? And I knew it would do that, but not me. I mean, these are all simple games, you know, two pound jackpot, three pound jackpot. You never heard of anyone putting 30 or 40 pounds in these back in the day. If you did, you had a problem. <laughs> Nowadays, you can put 30 or 40 pounds in the machine and be out of the arcade within like 10, 15 minutes. And that's another thing as well. The arcade used to say, amusements outside back in the day. Now they're called gambling centres or adult gambling centres. We've got ten nudges there. Right. I think I've got one fifty. Who would have thought they didn't have it then? We're gonna get a jackpot. Ow! <laughs> it was all about the fun playing it, wasn't it, back in the day? Now it's no fun at all. And I very rarely um, go into arcades now. Except for Mr. P's or Real Fruits, of course. Because they're all old machines there, anyway. But even some of them are too new for me. Not that I'm saying he hasn't done a good job on what he's done. Dave deserves all that credit. He does have machines that I quite like playing as well. Uh, 
Yeah, retro is definitely best. The old ten pence look. The old florin. Huh. Got loads of them. I just prefer all my old machines on the old money to be honest. Just look the part and they sound brilliant when they're paying out. Sean Nuts Gambler. Hey! Oh, it's definitely a long shot, that one is a long shot now, is it holding? No, no hold. Nudge. No. Need more than one, don't I? <laughs> As I know that was gonna happen, I need a three. Nudge now, come on. No. So we're going on the floor. Go for the bells. Come on, ding dong. Close. Look at that, these are on the old flooring as well, look. Uh. That slipped down one, didn't it? There, just in time. On your twenty feet token as well. Yeah, just so much more fun playing the little machines, the old machines. As it was back in the day, 1982 quid. They bought you, they bought you best part of fish and chips. <laughs>
need to. Oh, cheat. I believe there's new rules coming in uh, on YouTube next year. Well, next year, it's only going to be a couple of weeks, isn't it? I'm not sure what that means for my channel. All I know is I have to uh, stay to my videos that they're child friendly. Or even not. <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't know what the exact rules are. I wonder why that stayed lit. Well, we've got 150, haven't we? Uh, it just want to flash 50, 50, 50, 50. <laughs> we don't care, though. It's only fun, isn't it? That's all we ever played these for was fun. Twenty pence, wow. I collected that, shouldn't I? Go on, I'll put two more in. Yeah, so there it is. Um, good luck to all the people from Belfruit and hope uh, you find what you're looking for in the near future. And we are very saddened to hear about Belfruit closing. And uh, there's my little video. So I hope you enjoyed that. And I shall see you very soon on Chris217 channel. Bye for now.